So Nigel McGuinness is backstage with Tony Khan. Khan said, before AEW was founded, four pioneers, the Young Bucks, Cody Rhodes and Kenny Omega, all put on a show called All In. It was the biggest independent wrestling show of all time. And five years later, AEW is doing something big as well. They will be debuting in London, England, coming up on Sunday, August 27th, with All In. Khan would then state, now as far as where this show is taking place, we got to bring in somebody else who is akin to those four men I just named. And that's Adam Cole. Adam Cole would then walk in frame and say, hey, this show is taking place from Wembley Stadium. Yeah, Wembley Stadium. Now, earlier today, Fightful had a report that stated that many in the locker room thought that the London show was going to be the big announcement tonight, but that it would take place from the OVO Arena in Wembley. That's a 12,000-seat building. Not God dang Wembley Stadium that WWE did SummerSlam at with 80,000 or that um, what's his name? Oh, it's on the tip of my tongue. Tyson Fury had a fight at last year with 94,000. Now, that's the building that AEW is going to use. Wembley Stadium. The big building. The soccer stadium. I don't know if they get 70, 80, 90,000. That's going to be hard. Yeah. WWE did it. 80,000. Back in, what, 92? But then here's the other question. A, the show is called All In. Which is weird because they've never used the... Uh, well, mm, I get it now that I'm thinking of it. They now own the right to the All In name. Because they own Ring of Honor. Okay. But here's the weird thing. Usually, Labor Day weekend, which is the first weekend of September, they run All Out in Chicago. And... This Wembley show is essentially the week before that, the 27th, the week before the first week of September. So are we not getting a Chicago Labor Day weekend show this year from AEW? Is All In the new name and they're not using the All Out name anymore? I guess they're just going to use All In instead of All Out from, from now on. We don't know that for sure. But are they doing Chicago, Labor Day in Chicago? Is that show going to take place or not? Because it'd be weird if they did two big shows in a row. So is this the new norm? Or is this just a one-time thing? I don't know. I don't know what the plan is going to be going forward. But it is very interesting to see that they are doing it the week before Labor Day weekend. And that is not in Chicago. It is in London in Wembley. Wembley. 